Hello everybody, Max with Able and Website Pro here, and today we're going to be talking about sharing your Google Calendar so you can manipulate it. So here's the scenario. My client Josephine, she, she emailed me, she says, hey Max, I got four Gmail accounts and I want to be able to access those Gmail accounts from one Gmail account for the calendar, you know, so she can manipulate the calendar and see the events and so on and so forth. And I said, yeah, I'll, I'll make a tutorial for you and I'll show you how to do it. So <clears throat> let me uh, right what we're looking at here right now is my calendar, Maximus McCullough. It's for Maximus McCullough 29 at gmail.com. Now I have another uh, Gmail account that my son uses and this is his Google calendar right here. So on this particular browser, I'm logged into Maximus up close. All you have to do is click on this cog icon, go to settings and scroll down on the left hand side and select the calendar that you want to share and then right down here where it says share with specific people this is where you add the main email address so I'll put Maximus McCullough 29 right here now this is the important part as far as permissions make change make changes and manage sharing this gives you full control over this calendar when you click send that a main email address is going to receive a Gmail and letting you know that you have permission over this calendar. So let me get that off the way. Now look over here on the left. Whenever I refresh the page, you're going to see Harley's name appear. Okay. So right down here, you'll see Harley, Harley McCullough. Now over here on this day, Wednesday, January 9th, 2019, I can actually go in here and start adding events to his calendar. We'll just put a test event right here so I can show you what, how it works. And I'll click save, and now I added an event to that calendar. If I bring over his calendar and we go back, we'll just go back like this, you can see indeed that event was added to his calendar, and I have full control over it. If I wanted to, to delete the event, I would just click on here and delete the event and you will notice that whenever I bring the calendar over here that event is indeed deleted okay so that's how you can manage uh, you know several different Google calendars into one now if you ever wanted to revoke the access or you made a mistake and you needed to take access to a different Gmail account you will do the, repeat the same process click on the clock cog go to settings go down select the calendar that you want and then you want to click the share with specific people and it'll scroll you down and let me uh, if you hover over here you can see it says unshare calendar with Maximus McCullough and when we do that you will notice that the permissions for me now to edit his calendar are gone whenever I refresh a page so let me refresh the page and you can see now that Harley McCullough's calendar is off and that's it that's how you uh, can take all all different kinds of uh, Google calendars and share with uh, one uh, Gmail and have access to them and manipulate them and so you don't have to keep signing out and signing into with the other accounts all right this is Max with Avon website pro I hope this tutorial was beneficial to you I'll see you guys in the next video tutorial please like share and subscribe if I was able to help you with this video and I'll see you in the next one